Kiski do with another video. So I just wanted to tell you something. I'm still a little sick today, so I'll try to talk as well as I can. So as well as I wanted to show you my spray painted Nerf gun. So basically I use spray paint that's for plastic because it just bonds to plastic better. And yeah, I didn't put spray paint this because I wouldn't be able to go back. And I wouldn't be able to put on the barrel extension or the stock if I painted it. So as well as that, I painted this as well. This, the double magazine that was black. And this is purple. And it works fine. And also guys, excuse my voice. I know it's very bad. It's because I'm sick. I'm trying to do as best as I can. This is my, my, my throat sore. It's just kind of scratchy I should say so so what the f <laughs> so guys I'm really messed up I burped in front of you oh my gosh I burped in front of you I'm very sorry guys for burping in front of you so guys, I just want to let you know my voice is kind of scratchy, as you can tell probably already. <coughs> so let's get on with the review. I'll meet you back when so I have back the... back with the Nerf Strife that we will be reviewing today. Pretty much says 6 start motors blasting and strike elite strife. Fires up to 27 meters, which is... 90 feet here's the back of the box this pretty much shows everything about the nerf gun so tactical rail a quick clip reload uh, it's basically a six dart a six dart magazine that you can fit six darts in uh, motor tr tr trigger so you can fire up the motor and I'll read what it says for the strife. The one-handed motorized blaster equips you with the elite power and performance in compact high-speed package. Interesting. So, pretty much, and it's ages 8 and yeah. And basically, oh yeah, and it does not, and it's motorized, so you need power up with dose cell batteries, but they're not included. So make sure you bought extra batteries, and that is it. So I'm going to come back to you once I get it out of my box, out of the box. Again, I'm really sorry for my voice, like, oh my gosh. It's so bad right now, but so I'm back. Yeah. So what's included is the Nerf Strife itself, a six dart magazine, and six elite darts right here, fresh out of the box. So let's get started with the six dart magazine. So just to say guys, six darts is not enough. So if you have any bigger magazines or stuff, use that because for me, Personal opinion, six darts is not enough for this gun, this Nerf gun. So, to put your darts in here, you want the tips of the darts facing the tip of that arrow. Just like that. So you want the tips of the darts facing the front where that arrow is pointing. And how to equip it in the gun is you want the arrow pointing to the front of the gun. And you don't have to do anything, just put it in there, and bam, there, there it is, the magazine's in. Very simple, and if you want to put more darts in, just keep doing the same thing that I did. But you don't need to put in the magazine until you have the right amount of darts you have, or the amount you just want. So guys, also, right here, there's like a de-jamming thing, so you can see the dart right here. You can like... Take your darts out and everything. And also to shoot this gun, you may be wondering how. Just because it's motorized. So, see this little 
button right here. What you're gonna wanna do is press on that and listen. Listen to this, you're gonna press on that. It fires up the motor. And by the way, that's after you put batteries in. So to put batteries in, you have to unscrew this little screw and put the batteries in. So it fires up the motor. And then what you do is after you fire up the motor, so after you fire up the motor, after you fire up the motor, sorry, I'm kind of stuttering, you press down the trigger and it should shoot, so like this. See, it just shot, easy as pie. And to get the magazine out, this little button right here, you want to press down, you want to press that down, and then take the magazine out, just like that. Very simple stuff, right? So easy. And also, you can equip your modulus or stock, whatever you have, a barrel extension on here. I will just get those materials. Well, guys, after getting those materials, so I have the equipable pistol, the barrel extension from the recon, and the stock from the recon. So, to put the stock on, as you obviously need a stock, you take the gun. So, what you do is you put the stock on just like that. Easy enough, right? And to take it off, you press down these little orange things, and then take it off. Just like that. Very easy stuff. And to put on the barrel extension, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to tilt it to the side just like this and then you're going to put it on and turn it really easy and to turn it off let me take it off not turn it off you do this just turn it and it comes off and to put like something like a scope a quibble pistol you line up those tactical wheels this way like that and then slide it on and to take it off it's kind of difficult but you try to just like wiggle it off or something like that. Guys, so I'm going to meet you back for the shooting test. And then after the shooting test, I'm going to do the review. And sorry about my voice. It's like so bad. I'm really sorry about that. So guys, on that note, anyway, let's go and do the shooting test. So see you then. Hey guys, Bye. so I'm back with the shooting test. So, let's rev up that engine and start the shooting test for the Nerf sh Elite Strife. Here's my first shot. That looks like it went far. So here's my second shot. That went pretty far. So now let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Is that one? No. 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. 18 feet for the first shot. 19, 20, 21. So, 21 feet for the second shot. So, that's Owen Kid feet, guys. It was not lying, it did snow. So, guys, I'm going to meet you guys back in my bedroom for the review. See you then. I'm back with the review. Just before I actually do a rating on it, I just want to show you my personal combination for the Strife. Here it is. It's so huge, so what I add on to it. So on the back I had a stock. Very easy. And then I put a barrel extension with a clippable pistol at the end and put it on. And I also, and the last thing is, is a 25 dart drum so yeah let's get on to the rating so what I do is I give it a rating out of 5 for shooting battle and personal opinion so for shooting I probably give it a three and a half out of five because it did okay okay guys it did okay so three out of five three and a half out of five for shooting so so for battle since this is awesome to use Four out of five, since it's just awesome to use, but I wouldn't use it for like long range because you don't have the biggest range, but it's just so fun to 
pew pew your friends. It's so funny. I actually had a nerf roll with them before this just to see how it was. It's really awesome. And for personal opinion, it is 5 out of 5. I know, guys. First gun on my nerf reviews, and it's already 5 out of 5. Wow. So that gun is personally my favorite gun. I'm going to use it every nerf for now. It is so awesome. Like, oh my gosh. Like, it's so fun to use. So awesome. And yeah. Yeah, I just don't know what to say. It's such a good nerf gun. By this gun, it's really good. Really, really good. It shoots good and yeah. Pretty much it like but i wouldn't recommend using a six hour magazine because that's not gonna work okay not gonna work you just chew through six hour magazines way too fast in a short amount of time so yeah so guys pretty much i'm just gonna show you what i'm gonna review next i'm pretty i'm gonna review a water gun right here I'm also going to be reviewing a Zombie Strike crossbow right here, not saying their names because I want you to wait for those videos. Oh, look at this guy. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at that guy. Oh, yeah. And I'm also going to be reviewing. Couldn't say. Like, I'm also going to be. We're also going to be reviewing the Rough Cut 2 times 4 in the Zombie Strike series. Thing is, is I don't have it in my bedroom. That's why I look behind me. So yeah. That's pretty much it. And I also will be reviewing for book reviews. A book that I'm reading right now. See, it has a bookmark called Regenesis. It's a really good book, guys. So, on that note, bye.